All right, people, welcome back. More card review. So, I looked at Deathbot Base. I played with Deathbot. Deathbot 9 came out, and then I just never did a card review of it. I kind of just forgot about it, even though it's worth a card. Definitely worth a card talking about. So, Deathbot 9, yes. Yes, 9 Deathbots, people. Uh, Deathbot 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, Synchro Monster, Filled Spell. So, at least this is another card in your arsenal to use that Filled Spell with. Hopefully, pull it off. So, now all you need is, you know, 9 different Deathbot cards with different names. So that's about nine, one through nine. You don't need synchro monster anymore, or whatever. You you can you can have one missing, but that's about nine. How good is this card sound on? Uh, so of course five, six, seven, and eight were uh, pendulum based monsters. Nine isn't, and I was kind of thinking this. I was like, I was like, I was like, I was really hoping that. I was thinking maybe ten, maybe ten because you can't pendulum summon it. But nine, I I thought that they were gonna do some super awesome kick your butt boss monster. And does 9 fit that? Well, we'll find out. So this is Deathbot 9, looking like a badass. I mean, he's got the wings, the sword, the gun, the missiles. He's got, he's got the works. Like, he looks like he's about to fuck you up with his 500 attack defense. Anyway, he's the Earth Machine effect monster. Oh, guess what? Deathbot 9? Level 9. Woo! <laughs> uh, 500 attack, 500 defense. Alright, let's go ahead and look at his effect. He's not, not a pendulum monster, he's just an effect monster. Once per turn, during your main phase 1, you can have this card gain an attack equal to the combined attack of all Deathbot monsters you currently control, except for Deathbot 9, until the end of your opponent's turn. That is a lot of attack, you know, if you have, like, uh, Deathbot 1 boosting up, and, and Deathbot 3 boosting up, and Deathbot 2, like, there's, there's, a, there's a lot, there's a lot, it's all equal to all the combined attack of all the Deathbot monsters you currently control. That's a lot of attack, this thing could definitely be a threat. Uh, just because of all that attack, so uh, be wary. But don't, no, 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 because it's gonna come after you. But, mon <laughs> but watch this, watch this. Uh, monsters other than this card cannot attack turning after this attack. That's fine. All right. all right, that's fair. That's fair. Gain all this attack. I'm gonna kill you with this one strike. What? This card battles. Your opponent can activate card effects until the end of the damn step. Yep, our mate's effect. <laughs> our mate's effect. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> very powerful. Very powerful. And just to top it off, this card be destroyed by battle or by card effect. You can destroy one Deathbot card you control instead. So this big old Deathbot beater, and just when you think that you're just gonna be like, all right, well let me just go ahead and destroy him. Nah, nah, you can destroy a different Deathbot instead. Deathbot uh, card, so you can even destroy your Pendulum scales and have your Pendulum scales go off and get their effects, uh, you know, five and six. So yeah, and I believe I believe that, uh, when uh, Major Capital G talked about this card, there's like there's an there's an OTK. What's this card? It's two card OTK. Well, which will have like a, a I think a fourteen thousand attack. That's about nine after you. Yeah, and you know how Utopia the Lightning with that five thousand Armadies. It's fourteen thousand. Like, hopefully you have something in defense mode. I mean, at least this monster doesn't have Pierce. Yeah, at least they, they didn't give it Pierce, but hopefully you have something that's not gonna be an attack mode. You're probably gonna be killed. I think it's I think it's, you summon Despot three, and three will summon two. Get the search, search for uh. Nine, machine do. So your two cards are three and uh and machine do. Both at three. They both should be at three in your deck in your in your death spot deck. So no surprise there. Uh, well, definitely now with this play. Uh, I've seen a couple decks drop it down two, but with this play, three. Um, machine do your two. Special summon two more twos. Of course, uh, get your search on through uh both twos because two's not once per turn. So you already search one. Two search nine. The other two search your pendulum scales. Obviously, search your pendulum scales. Pendulum summon nine. He's he's nine. The death spot scales are between one and ten. So pendulum summon nine. Why not? Uh, then I believe that death spot uh, two gives all your machine monsters five hundred attack defense for each. I want to say uh, off the top of my mind, I should probably look, but I think death spot two. Yeah, all machine monsters you control gain 500 attack and defense, except this card. So you would have three on the field, so all your despot monsters would gain 1500, including, uh, uh, nine, right? So, everybody's, everybody's pretty much 2000, right? Everybody's, everybody's pretty much 2000. Then, you can go ahead and use, uh, despot three's effect, uh, wait, three's effect where you can, like, well, once per turn during either player's turn, you can target one death spot monster you control against 500 attack and defense for each death spot card you can control, which would be death spot 9 itself, death spot 3, the 3 death spot 2s, and your pendulum scales. So that's 7. So that's 3,500 attack on top of the 2,000 attack that you're gaining from, oh, the 1,500 that you're gaining from each death spot 
two. So we have fifty five hundred, right? Right, fifty five hundred. Uh, then, and top it all off, Death Spot Nine effect. He can't make none of your other Death Spots can attack, but he will gain the attack of all other Death Spots on the field. So I think I did maybe the math wrong, but still, this is not chunk of damage because he'll go ahead. All the other Death Spot monsters, you have four Death Spot monsters on. No, I didn't do that. Because you'll have four Death Spot monsters on the field, each at two thousand attack. They're already at fifty five, right? Go ahead and uh, slurp up that 8,000 attack. Because it's 2,000 from each. You gain all their attack. So, I, I said 4,000 or 35. Uh, 1,350 still. 1,350 Armadies attack. Just done. Like, two card combo. So, I can, I can definitely see some shenanigans with Death Spot 9. And uh, it's definitely a card they needed. I was kind of iffy on the field spell, but I'm glad they got a card like this. And I can't wait to see what Death Spot 10 is if they decide to do 10. And 11 and 12, like, I don't know. I don't know. Are they just going to keep on going for every single level? I mean, because if Death Spot 9 does this, then what's 10 going to do? What's 11 going to do? What's 12 going to do? Like, oh my god. So, anyway, tell me what you guys think about Death Spot 9 in the comment section below. So, I hope that you guys can, uh, enjoyed this card review. Like I said, I never said I was a great Death Spot player. I was probably the worst Death Spot player ever. But at least I figured out this combo, right? So I wish this card was out when I was playing Death Spots on Daily Duels because I would have been shooting for this. Uh, and just game, gaming my opponent with ease. Because, God, just, they, they did this card right. So tell me what you guys think. Thanks for watching.